Hello LEGO friends, Matt from Brooksburgs here, and today it's time for another Ask Matt segment. Stay tuned to hear your questions answered. Woohoo! Alrighty folks, welcome back to another Ask Matt segment. Thank you again to all the folks that contribute to these questions that I get to bring back to you folks in these segments. And remember, if you want to ask a question, please do so in the comments below. I will record it and answer it in an upcoming segment. With that in mind, let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty, this week's first question comes to me from, of course, <laughs> my biggest supporter of these, these segments here, Nate, aka King Blue. And this week, Nate is asking, Matt, What's your favorite place to buy coffee from? Well, unfortunately, some at least some days, unfortunately for sure. I'm not really a coffee drinker. Um, it's it's twofold. First of all, I don't really care for hot beverages, so that kind of negates the main idea of coffee in my opinion. And I have tried iced coffee as well, because I do prefer cold beverages, of course. And that also just doesn't work for me. And the reason being, is not that I don't really care for the flavor because I do put in some sweetener and some cream to try to help, but anytime that I've actually consumed coffee in a liquid form like that, no matter Dunkin' Donuts or just what regular home coffee, whatever it is, it does not settle very well in my stomach. I don't know why. It's just one of those things that can't settle. It upsets my stomach, so I just avoid it, and I drink other things. <laughs> so there you go. So I can't give you a really a place because I don't drink it. All right, and our second question comes to me from Law Lego, aka Greg Bissett. Greg is asking this week, how many tables may you add to your city? Well, given the limitations of the physical room that I'm in for that space, which is the second largest of the three rooms I have in my townhouse right now, um, at this point, I can probably only really realistically add one more to create a square or a rectangle. And that is on the plate of things to do at some point here. I've not gotten the other things I need to do completed before I want to do that. But to do the work that I want to do in terms of adding more things to the city, namely an industrial section, I'm going to have to add another table at the entrance of my room, basically, to do that. So, there's your answer. One more table. <laughs> Alright, and that's going to wrap up this week's Ask Matt segment. I'm um, running a bit low on questions at the moment, so anybody watching, please feel free to submit more questions on anything generic, LEGO-related, whatever may suit you. And I'll be happy to answer in upcoming segments. A reminder that I have moved this to a bi-weekly or every two weeks. So, you got plenty of time to develop more questions and please let me know what they are. I'll be happy to answer them. I do have a couple more upcoming for the next segment. But at this point, <laughs> that'll be kind of the end of questions. So please send me some more <laughs> if you want this to continue. As always, though, I certainly do appreciate it. It really does uh, help me to entertain you guys with some content. You get to know me more. And again, thank you so much for watching. I certainly do appreciate it. If you haven't, be sure to follow me over on Twitch where I do my weekly live streams. I certainly appreciate that support. It's a lot of good times over there. And if you haven't, please be sure to subscribe here. Hit that like button, notification bell, all that good stuff. Comment or thought below. Leave a question below. Certainly would help. And until next time, thank you so much for watching. This is Matt saying adios. Bye.